in a world that's constantly throwing challenges our way, what if I told you that the secret to success and fulfillment lies not in the hurdles we face, but in how we choose to face them? Yeah. Have you ever considered that your biggest challenges could actually be your greatest privileges? Well, today I'm going to share a story that might just change the way you see the world, a story of laughter, a late night game, and a revelation that left the table of professional speakers speechless. Stick around because you're about to discover a perspective shift that might just be the key to unlocking your fullest potential. Hey there, audacious parents. Welcome to the Dark Horse Entrepreneur Podcast, where we're not just about surviving, we're about thriving. If you're tuning in, you're not looking for just another feel-good, pat-on-the-back kind of show. No. You're here because you're ready to disrupt the status quo. You're ready because you're here to challenge your limits and to step out of the comfort zone where we know growth never happens. This is not just your average, let's all be happy with our nine to five lives kind of podcast. We're here to give you actionable strategies. We're here to dive deep into the world of side hustles, digital marketing, and smart income boosting tactics. Why you may ask? Because we're designed for parents like you. Parents juggling family expenses, childcare, and the elusive me time. We're not just about making money though, we're about designing a life. A life that you dictate, not one that's been pre-packaged in a soul-sucking 9-5 box. So, if you're ready to break free and design a life that aligns with your dreams, design a life that aligns with your family, you're in the white place. The Dark Horse Entrepreneur Podcast. Hey there, my success seekers and champions. Welcome back to another episode of Yours Podcast, a place where we help you unlock your true potential and transform your life. I am your host, Tracy Brinkman, and boy, do I have a story for you today. I want you to imagine this. A group of friends, and every single one of them are professional speakers. They're all unwinding after a long day, laughter's filling the air, and a game that's about to take a surprising turn. It's a story that made us all stop in our tracks and evaluate, actually reevaluate everything. It's all about a simple card game. Now, today we'll be diving deep into the power of perspective. How do you view the challenges in your life? Are they roadblocks or are they stepping stones? We're here to flip the script and show you how to turn your challenges into your greatest privileges. So buckle up because this is going to be a game changer. Let me set the stage for you. Like I said earlier, it was one of those long, grueling days of giving it our all on the stage. You know what I'm talking about. Being that public speaker, pouring your heart and soul out into every word, out into every single gesture. And as the day wrapped up, 10 of us found ourselves at the far end of the hotel bar, ready to let loose and share a few giggles and a few laughs. And what better way to do that than with a game of Cards Against Humanity, yeah, right? Now, if you've never played this, let me tell you, it's not for the faint of heart. It's outrageous, it's hilarious, and it's downright irreverent. And for a bunch of speakers who had just spent their days choosing their words carefully, it was the perfect way to unwind. The Dark Horse, the Dark Horse Entrepreneur Podcast. Now, as the cards were dealt and the laughter drew louder, one of my friends, amidst the chaos, made a comment that struck a chord. You know, he said... We have so many first world challenges. And just like that, everyone nodded in agreement. And it was true. Let's be honest. We're all living in a world of privilege. Yet, we often find ourselves bogged down by the smallest of challenges. But then, in a moment of clarity, or maybe it was courage, that comes through via a good belly laugh, I chimed in. I prefer to think of it as first world privileges. And just like that, the entire room went silent. A table full of professional speakers and not a single word. Yeah, not a one of us had a single word to say. You see, in that moment, something shifted and we were all guilty of it. Focusing on our challenges, focusing on our hurdles, and focusing on those little beady inconveniences. But what if we flipped the script? What if... Instead of seeing challenges, we saw privileges, opportunities to grow, opportunities to learn, and opportunities to make a damn good difference. And that, my friends, is the power of language. 
It shapes our reality. It shapes our perspective of the world around us. It's not just the words that we speak out loud. No, no. It's about the words that we tell ourselves. It's about the stories that we believe in. And in that moment, every single one of us sitting around that table realized the impact our words had on our own lives. So, as we dive deeper into the story, I want you to think about this from the perspective of your own life. Where are you focusing? On the challenges or are you focusing on the privileges? I want you to hang around here because we're about to explore how this simple little shift can completely transform your life. Now, let's dive into this concept that has the power to completely transform your life. What you focus on is what you get. Yeah? It, it sounds so simple, right? But then again, the implications, if you ponder it for a, a brief moment, are completely profound. Your focus determines your reality. Yeah, it's like the Matrix, if you think about it. Neo, yeah, I've seen it time and again. Let's talk about Sandra, for example. She was an entrepreneur struggling to get her business up off the ground every day. Yeah, you know, you know it. She was focusing on the challenges. She was focusing on the rejections, and she was focusing on every single one of those opportunity doors that were literally and metaphorically slammed in her face. And what did she get? Well, she got what she was focusing on. More challenges, more rejections, and more slamming doors. But then, then, obviously with the help of a, a coach, she made a shift. Instead of focusing on the challenges, she began focusing on the privileges. The opportunity to pursue her passion the freedom to create her own path, and the lessons that she learned through every single one of those rejections. Remember what I've said time and again? It's not failure, it's feedback. The Dark Horse, the Dark Horse Entrepreneur Podcast. And suddenly Podcast. her business, yeah, it started to grow. Opportunities started to appear, sprouting up like magic mushrooms everywhere. Her outlook shifted more to the positive. And guess what? Success followed. Isn't that amazing how that happens? And that, my friends, is the power of focus. When you shift your focus from challenges to privileges, from what's going wrong to what's going right, your entire world is going to change. You start to see the opportunities instead of just the obstacles. You start to see the green grass and not just the brick wall. You start to see the lessons instead of just the losses. Now, my success seekers... I told you I was going to keep dropping in um, Tracy's top tip, but we're going to change the name of this. We're going to call this segment Whiskered Wisdom. And for those of you who have met me, understand why I'm calling it Whiskered Wisdom. And for those of you who haven't, I have a beard that is probably almost down to my belly button, maybe about three inches from my belly button. So, and it's all white. Well, maybe it's got a little bit of gray in it, but for the most part, it's all white. So imagine a gentleman that looks very much like Gandalf, and that would be me. This is where I share my top tip, my top nugget, my nugget of wisdom to help you on your journey to success. And today's Whiskered Wisdom is all about making that shift in focus. So my friends, here's my tip. Start and end your day by listing three of your privileges in life. I don't care what it is. Start and end your day by listing three of the privileges in your life. It could be your health. It could be your family. It could be your passion. It could be anything that you're grateful for. This simple shift in your focus from what's lacking to what is abundant, and maybe you don't feel like it's abundant, but you know what? It's there, and it's in your life. It sets a positive tone for your day and helps you end on a high note. Trust me. It's a game changer. So, my success seekers and my challenge champions, my opportunity champions, that, that, that's the words. Use the words carefully. As we wrap up today's episode, let's recap the main takeaways, shall we? We talked about the power of perspective. We talked about how shifting your focus from challenges to privileges. Call them privileges. Call them opportunities. You have the privilege of having it presented before you. How you use it is up to you. Having that shift in your focus from challenges to privileges can completely transform your life. We heard some stories of individuals who made that shift and reaped those rewards. And we shared in a simple 
Whiskered Wisdom, a powerful exercise that you can use starting right this minute to help you shift your own life. Now, I want to leave you with a thought. Every challenge in your life is an opportunity in disguise. We've heard this a thousand times. It's a chance to grow. It's a chance to learn. And it's a chance to come out stronger on the other side. Remember, my friends, this is me telling you it's not failure. It's feedback. The Dark Horse the Dark Horse Entrepreneur Podcast. And the more feedback you get, the more learning opportunities you have. And the more learning opportunities you have, the more data you have. And the more data you have, the better you can execute the next time. It's not failure. It's feedback. So, my success seekers and my opportunity champions, I challenge you to make that shift. Focus on your privileges. Focus on the opportunities. Focus on the abundance. And watch your world transform right before your eyes. All right. Thank you for joining me today. And thank you for thank you for making me a part of your journey. I really honestly am humbled by it. And again, remember, you have the power to change your life. Do you have the power to turn your challenges into those greatest privileges? Until next time, keep pushing forward, keep striving for greatness, and never forget, you are an opportunity champion. You are a success seeker. As we bring today's journey to a close, I have a couple of things I want to share with you. Right, real quick. You with me? Stick around. Just be a minute. Okay. This is the part where you get to take action. This is the part where you get to become part of the Dark Horse Entrepreneur community. First off, I want to hear from you. Yep, that's right. You. I'm pointing at you right now. Head on over to the website. The link is down in the show notes. DarkHorseEntrepreneur.com And leave me a voicemail. Yeah. No kidding, a voicemail. Go down there. There'll be a little button. When you go to the website, there'll be a button down there on the lower right-hand side. It's a microphone. Oh, duh. Click on it, and you can leave me a voicemail. I believe it's uh, got a two-minute limit, but share your stories. Ask your burning questions, or even suggest topics that you want to hear about in future episodes. To me, your voice matters, and I'm here to listen, and I'm here to guide you on your path to success. So I need to hear from you. I want to hear from you sincerely. And if you have to leave a message longer than two minutes, leave multiple messages. I don't care. I'm happy to listen to them all. And hey, here's the other thing. If today's episode resonated with you at all, if it sparks something inside you, don't keep it all to yourself. Share it with someone that you know will get benefit from it. Yeah, spread the wisdom. Spread the love. Let's create a ripple effect of positive chains together. And lastly, my success seekers, if you haven't already taken a moment to rate, review, or subscribe to this podcast on your favorite platform, well, why not? Right? Here's the thing. Your support means the world to me. And on the other side of that, it helps me reach so many more people just like you. People who are totally ready to transform their lives. So, as we wrap up, I want to leave you with this thought. Your life doesn't get any better by chance. Mm -mm, No, no. It gets better by change. So take the lessons from today, make that shift in perspective, and start seeing your world through the lens of privilege and opportunity. Privilege is not a bad word, ladies and gentlemen. You are capable of greatness. You have the power to turn your challenges into privileges, into opportunities. So get out there, take action, and never stop striving for the life that you dream, that you desire, and I believe you deserve. Thank you for joining me today, my success seekers and champions. Until next time, keep pushing forward, keep dreaming big, and remember, think successfully and take action. Hey, my Dark Horse entrepreneur parents, thanks for tuning in. If this episode struck a chord, share it with a fellow parent hustler. Let's grow our tribe that thrives, not just survives. For more insights and a community that totally gets it, join our Facebook group at www.darkhorseschooling.com backslash tribe. Think successfully and take action.